when it comes to the direction of creative, uh, that responsibility belongs to you. So much of what you accomplished in that role in NXT, especially with that, that big match takeover feel, is on display in WWE. For me, it's the, the build to Nakamura's debut, I think it was 2016, we talked about Sami Zayn. But were there key moments to help shape your vision uh, as head of creative while you were in NXT? Oh my God, so many moments, right? Um, it's funny, I, I, I don't necessarily always look at it as like, what moments did we create that shaped the vision of what, what went, what didn't? I, I sort of always approach it as just, what do I want to see? Um, luckily for me, I think you've heard Sean say this as well, we approach this like fans, right? We approach this, I'm a kid sitting on the couch how would, I, how would I make this the biggest thing I've ever seen? And I was fortunate in my career, that kid was fortunate in his career to sit next to some of the greatest minds in this business. So, you know, I sat next to them and absorbed it and, you know, paid attention to all of it, whether it was, you know, the guys I was in the ring with on my side, opposite side of the ring for me, or the people like Dusty that I got to go and create with in NXT mm -hmm. and um, create a lot of those incredible moments and along the way learned from those successes, but I think I also learned, you know, as much in those failures, you know, um, as, mu as much as the internet likes to point out failures, the people that point them out to the most are the people creating them we're the most aware of them. And they're the things that keep us up at night. So the, the things that you honestly, I don't, I don't believe in them being failures, I believe in them being opportunities to learn. So the things that worked there, I, I learned from. But the things that didn't work there, I really learned from. The things when I was here that I watched that I thought, that didn't work, why? How would I get there a different way? What would I have done differently? Um, that's how I approach it. I think it's how Sean approaches it. I think that if you're, a fan, very man once told me, put your put yourself in the seat. You'll never go wrong. Um, if you can keep that mentality your whole career, then I think you're onto something. So that's how we approach it. If it's working, I'm happy. Denise Salcedo, Instinct Cold.